Good morning, happy Tuesday. Uh, I've had a little walk with Charlie, but I am really aching now. I can feel the efforts of all these power walks. Um, so I've got a shorter one planned for today, but I'll tell you about that later. Um, so my breakfast today is my usual coffee uh, with almond milk. Then I've got 45 grams of blueberry wheat from Morrison's. Then I've got the, that's my health extra B. Uh, then the, sorry I'm not awake yet this morning. The raspberry donut flavour yoghurt for one and a half sins and some defrosted blueberries. So that's my health extra B for 45 grams of blueberry fruit wheats and one and a half sins for the yoghurt. Right, it's finally lunchtime after a busy morning and I was settling down to my lunch. So I've got the other half of my roast butternut squash which I do in the oven. I've topped that with a small 200 gram tin of baked beans which are free on the plan and 40 grams of light cheese for my first healthy extra. Um, I've used these Marks and Spencer's lighter mature cheese bars which are 20 grams each. They are not on the app as an official Healthy Extra A, but I do count 40 grams. I've grated two of them as a Healthy Extra. Uh, then I've got that with a salad. I've also got chilli flakes on my butternut squash. Potato, uh, potato, tomatoes, peppers, green leaves, onion and cucumber. And then I've got if I've already shown you this before, I apologise, but I've got the Thousand Island Skinny Sauce Dressing, which I count as free on the plan as it's zero calorie. It is really, really nice. And if I was going to repurchase, I'd definitely um, include that one in a repurchase because it tastes really, really nice on a salad. I've got a apple and a banana and a lemonade. So this is my afternoon snack and I forgot to say earlier that I didn't have a morning snack, I just had a peppermint tea this morning. But for this afternoon I've got another coffee. It's actually made with half almond milk and half skim milk because I have now made the transition to skim milk which is 350 ml for your Healthy Extra A. Half a tub of cork with 5 grams of chocolate powder for one sin and a chopped pear. Right, time for evening meal and I have got one of the Slimming World Thai style fish cakes. So these are new out from the Iceland Slimming World range. Thai style fish cakes free on the plan. Aromatic free cod and salmon fish cakes blended with fragrant Thai spices. So I've got one of those there with carrot and potato chips and mixed veg sprinkled with paprika carrots, broccoli and cauliflower. I've got a bit of the skinny sauce tomato ketchup. I've just put it on the side instead of on top. Um, mayonnaise would probably have been better but I don't have any at the moment so we're going to go with tomato sauce. Then I've got the other half of my, it's not quark actually, it's fat free greek style yoghurt. Uh, so I had half this afternoon and half now. Oops get down which is one sin and a chopped pear with my Vimto <laughs> get off get off <laughs> no uh, with my um, watermelon strawberry and peach no added sugar Vimto so, thoughts on the fish cakes are very nice. I had one, as you've seen. They are, I didn't really taste any, um, like, I thought the salmon would be quite strong, but it's not a strong fishy flavour at all. It's a nice fishy flavour. They compare okay to the Morrison's fish cakes. Obviously, they're nowhere near as nice with the cheesy centre and the mash the mashed fish inside the Morrison's fish cakes but they are nice the Slimming World ones. Um, they're packed full of veg. Um, 
Mine, you have to cook them for half an hour on, was it 200 degrees? Yeah. Yeah. And the packed full of veg, and my veg was still a little bit hard, but it, they were okay. Um, they're, not, they're not dry, they're mm -hmm. nice. You probably might like a, some kind of little bit of sauce with them. Some mayonnaise, tomato ketchup, sweet chilli. That was the other thing. They have a, a slight kick to them, but I didn't find them very, very spicy. So if you want more spicy, I would probably add like your sweet chilli sauce or something like that. Or what you could do... If you wanted them to be a bit more like the Morrison's fish cakes, melt in the middle, you could put a bit of your Healthy Extra A cheese on the top. That would be nice. But but yeah, I really enjoyed them for free. Uh, to be free on the plan, they're really, really nice. Um, whether they're filling or not, I think you need to make sure you're having a fully food optimised meal with them. So if you're having one fish cake, you need to have some protein and carbohydrates with them. Plenty, uh, sorry, your fish will be your protein. You need to have your free food and your speed food on your plate like I did. Um, and my pudding was really filling as well with it being fat-free Greek style yogurt. So yeah, that's my view on the fish cakes. If and when I go to Iceland, I w would get another box. And the other thing is, I have put another post on my community board on YouTube. So if you can, if you're able to, can you please go and check that out and vote in my little poll. So next will be supper. Um, but first I'm going to go and put my pyjamas on and do some prep for tomorrow. So um, before you see my supper, I'll have put my pyjamas on, made my breakfast and got something out of the freezer for tomorrow's lunch and evening meal. Good evening, it's just coming up to 8 o'clock and it's time for my evening snack. So I'm having the last of my Slimming World hummus, that's done me four portions as I made it on Saturday afternoon. I've got a Dairy Milk Little Bar, uh, which is five sins, celery sticks and an Easy Peeler, which are both speed and free on the plan. A packet of Cheeto Puffs, which are three and a half sins. And my coffee, which is actually made with 90ml of skimmed milk. And looking at that, I don't think I will need to use as much skimmed milk as I do almond milk. But I'll, I'll see how I go tomorrow. So there is... <coughs> excuse me. Eight and a half sins there. And I've already had three and a half sins. That puts me at, I think, 12 and a half sins, I think. Um, so I'm going to try and finish on that 12 and a half sins. Um, but I do have two and a half sins worth of these licorice sweets left. So I'm going to leave those out and see if I fancy them. And if I do have them, I'll try and remember to tell you tomorrow. But otherwise, I'm ending on 12 and a half sins and 7,000 steps. Thanks for watching.